Okay, greetings game changers. This is Classic Games Redefined. My name's Rich, and I would be off camera, but anyhow, uh, we're going to do it because I wanted to show you something now, which you'll see in the title below. But anyhow, I don't know if unboxing is the right word. I've gone through this before, but I wanted to show it. Uh, and probably somebody else did, but I'm going to take my time to go through it. It is Pyramid Arcade by it's a Looney Labs and there's the back of the box you can see it has 22 games in the box the rules I mean we'll get to the rules in a minute uh, but I want to show how the packaging is here so what you have here is you have 22 games okay you see this and uh, it's over 20 it says 22 games from another world in the box let's see if we can open it up Open it up right here, I'm trying an unboxing video, and then you go through, and uh, what you get here is, I want to show you the inside, I'm going to move this down a bit, here we go, okay. you get the manual, which is pretty hefty, a bunch of games here, and I said there's 22, uh, there are hundreds of games you can play with, this is, this is the box, version of Looney Labs, uh, their ice house pieces are now pyramid pieces. And you have a bunch of rules in here for a range of games, abstracts, history of the pyramids, you see that there, World War V, a risk-like game, that's an abstract strategy game, they got this stuff here, a dexterity game, it's got a lot of bits in there. So you have the, on one side, the Martian chessboard, and... That's one. You have here is you have uh, this is World War Five. We'll just play with the pyramids. Here's our catalog. You have this is one of the boards they have. Volcano, and there might be some other things. Five by five board. Another thing which I have. They've had I've had the ice house pieces for a while. And color wheel and petri dish game they have in it. Then what you do is you get into the middle here. I'm going to take this out. I want to show you the inside. Okay, there's more stuff here. But if you want to look, let me move that down. If you look at this tray that we have, it has the pieces in it. And I'm going to spin it around so you can see the other side of it. This is really an awesome thing. By the way, just to let you see how they have, this is typically nest, a nested formation. Ah, pulled it out. And there's 10 colors here, and they have three sets of these. If you see here, there's one, two, three, kind of like a cold nested, because you have the Russian nesting dolls. So let me see if I can pull back a little bit. You have, you have the one pit piece, smallest one. There it is. You have the one pit. You have the two pip, two pipper. Put the two pip on top of the one pit, put away. This is a three pip, which is the largest one. Another thing, too, also, these were usually sharp. I made jokes about cantropes with these, uh, but actually they're now brushed off. This is really, really nice. So let's go back to more of the stuff they have in here. You get a nice little bag for here. And um, German Arcade. Um, this is a selection so is the games in the box if you want to do random it was like in the rules that talked about doing a set of tournament which i'm always a fan of doing mixing games up there this is a deck of playing cards used for one of their games they had a game uh, i think zakara which used tarot cards or something else they had that and what you have here is you have the cards or ace do that you have your typical spades hearts clubs etc but what they do here is also to throw these in. You have a fifth suit, which is diamonds. I mean, not diamonds. I mean, stars. They, they go away through king, all the way up to king. So it's a fifth one they have. No jokers in it. You have these, which were actually shrink-wrapped, and I just took them out and put them back in there. Let's see what else we have here. It's expensive. I managed to pick up some stuff over the holidays, so yeah, penny. But these are really nice stuff here. You have this, uh, you know, I'll box that up later. We'll go across. Um, cards for the game Twin Win. Dice for their various games they have. 
okay, different games. You'd have to look at the rule book they have for it. Starship Captain. Uh, there are different coat, um, a coin thing. I think it's a starter coin. It's my turn, the turn marker. Then you have these coasters, which they had, they've done games in the past. You have two types in here. So I'm not going to take it out now. You have the round ones, and there's two of them. And then you have these here. They have those. Plus, there's the thing to show you again here. You have the nice tray. Going off back. Ah, that's the best way to do this. You can see that they're, they're really nice in there. So anyhow, just wanted to show this off. We'll get to this later. So, yeah, that's about it. I'm going, what I'm going to do, I picked, there's a piece pack set I picked up also. Some other stuff. I'm doing board games and video game stuff. That's what I do with this channel. Uh, I will be showing off some of my stuff here. I'm a big fan of game systems like that. So, anyhow. That's the latest. If this camera's small, well, I'm doing the best I can here. So anyhow, so that's about it. That's a somewhat unboxing going through the stuff there. Again, I sorted through it before. I have some other stuff there. Uh, there was no rules for Zendo in it. Actually, what I could probably do here is let me read the list of the games that comes with this before as an outro. Okay. And you got the book here. So let's see if I can find table contents here. Um, yeah, uh, Black Ice, Color Wheel, Give or Take, Hijinks, Homeworlds, Ice Dice, Ice Tower, uh, Ice Towers, uh, Launchpad 23, Looney Ludo, uh, Lunar Invaders, Martian Chess, uh, Pedal Battle, and Petri Dish, and they have Nano Fiction Intermission, and then we have Pharaohs, Powerhouse, that Nano Fiction uh, Intermission is just very short, tiny stories that they have, uh, Andrew Looney was the one who did it. Uh, we have Pharaoh Powerhouse, uh, Pyramid, Shambo, Treehouse, uh, Twin Win, Vertical, Volcano, World War V, and Zark City. If I mentioned Zarkana earlier in this video, Zark City is a reworking. It's been reworked twice. Uh, and it was a game on tarot cards. An interesting game here. And what I'm going to do here is there are other ones online that you can go with also. Also, all this stuff mentioning with that. History of the Pyramids goes into the history of the game. Let me get to the other ones that they have here. 20, 22 more great games to explore. And you can go to the website. Go to Looney Web's website. Oh, before that, he also has a game design challenge for a game he's calling uh, Glots. Three different versions. One using a chessboard. Uh, you have the other one, which is using pyramids. And then the use of the cards. And let me read some of the other ones that you can go online for. Uh, Apophis, Egyptian Solitaire, Freeze Tag, Glebes and Grooves, Lager, Time Lock, Penguin Soccer, Ice House. That was the very first game. That's where these pyramid things actually had the name. It was called Ice House. Um, and here's one of the colors. These were originally Ice House pieces. Now they're pyramids. Um... So we had that here. Ice House, Quicksand, Torpedo, Undercut, Alien City, Blam, Builders of Riley, uh, Gnostica. Uh, I think they use other equipment here. Gnostica was the tarot cards. That was like one of the earlier ones here. Um, it was based on Zarkana, which was the original. And that was pretty wild. They had ones out there. Pikeman, uh, Pylon, Rambots, Stack Control, Subdivision, Synaptice, and Zendo. I heard word when I picked this up that they're going to be redoing Zendo with spheres, half spheres, and also cones. Which will be interesting, and I wonder if that will be added to these sets here, and naturally you get more pieces, so you have three types in shape. Which lends Zendo. Zendo is one of my favorite deduction games, or it's an induction game. So anyhow, uh, that's about it from my end here. I'll try to see if I get other stuff here. I'm hoping I have audio with this video. I just It looks like it's recording, but anyhow. Okay, that's it. I'm out of here. I'm going to try to upload the video when I can. I, my Wi-Fi looks like it's out, so I'm figuring I'll record now. So, And uh, I'm going to check out of here, and that's the latest. So I do want to thank you for watching. May your die always roll five. And remember, don't hit, don't hit the player. Change the game. Okay? I'm out of here. Take care.